school should not be the tutor since usually it's the most like the busy, busy person yeah. in yeah. the school. So for sure he cannot follow the person and also he doesn't have like the real strict relationships to the teachers. Okay. And maybe it's better at this point that one teacher, maybe an English teacher or I don't know, is the tutor directly of the person. Yeah. Maybe if her tutor was a teacher or a person from CD, uh, mm -hmm. that maybe it would be better. Yeah. <laughs> So that's why I think like if our tutor was a teacher, that yeah. would be easier thing. Yeah. Because with CPO, I mean, I have a lot of work and they, uh, it's different. They mm -hmm. check if everyone is in school and everything goes well. Well, teachers, they can explain, they can just show how it works. Mm -hmm. Just, we can grasp this tacit knowledge, just yeah. like ladies, mm -hmm. very fast and easily. And then automatically, with no guessing, with you no have guessing. more commitment from teachers if one teacher is at least the tutor. Yeah. Was Yes, and they have to take into account that you're there and that you want to do something. <laughs> they don't like give value to the education of one person before they are the person. So it's not like I'm Italian, I should just do things related to Italy. I should do things that are also related to my interest and my previous education. So yeah. it's like because they know everything about us. Like they yeah, saw already. our CV, yeah. they know what we studied. They knew this months, sometimes before we arrived. So they could have easily had just one single meeting with all the teachers to inform them that someone is coming who studied uh, classic languages and someone is coming who studied. Um, biology, biology. <laughs> and so on. It's coming with yeah, but also like the general interest that you have, and maybe one person is more like focused on I don't know sustainability. One person on like ethic consumptions and things like that. So just like give some value to the things that you yeah. want to yeah. do. And how can we integrate yeah. that in the things that we're teaching yeah. this year? But no, I don't think they gave a single thought to that before the first day that we got there. <laughs> because now we have to convince people all the time mm -hmm. yeah. that it's worth inviting us. Yeah, we're little aliens in the school, <laughs> little aliens. <laughs> it's our job, stalking teachers. <laughs> wait, wait! Like, when they open the door after the lesson, they see me like, bonjour! <laughs> Can I ask a question? No eye contact. <laughs> Well, also, but if but if you manage to do something, usually it's it's out of blue. I mean, it happens suddenly, just like this. Like yeah. it, like this morning, I I learned that tomorrow at nine <laughs> or no at ten, I'm gonna have another presentation of, like to do. Yeah. I mean. Yeah, sometimes like a little bit of planning, it's a little just bit a more teacher communication. Yeah. Seeing you walking outside, and they're like, Ah, I have an idea. Tomorrow. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, no, it, I think it must be in professional communication field, and it's not not like not not in the canteen, not somewhere on the WhatsApp or something. It must be something like in a real job, like like, yeah. like how we yeah. do it normally. Because the way it goes now, like if I'm invited last minute to come to a class, I'm not involved in the preparation at all. So I have no idea what we're gonna be doing. Then I'm standing in this classroom, like, okay, yeah. um, what do they know? What are we gonna do? And yeah. they give us like almost no responsibility because yeah. but then also I think we discussed like maybe it's just better to have two volunteers in each school at yeah. least you're not completely yeah. alone yep. sitting in an office waiting yeah. for time to pass and also and you can collaborate. The first month. because now we figured out that everything it's works better, better if we yeah. work if on things together yeah. and if we exchange and yeah. you have each other's support yeah. Yeah. yeah for sure because like in the first month, especially, you don't go and take the first step. But if there is like another person, maybe you can also like start to push yeah. your project since the very first mm -hmm. moment and not wait like months yeah. To, yeah. to develop something that is yours. So it's better like to be in tune. Yeah, so and so. maybe even like get some students involved as tutors or to introduce yeah. the EVS yeah. to like what is happening at the school and yeah. delegate the class so. yeah <laughs> no and also the school system like they didn't explain really um, okay what are the courses even about I had yeah. no idea what is uh, enseignement morale et civique or the fact that they teach history and geography together and what does it mean and all these things like what is the good 
type of class where you could intervene as an EBS? Yeah. They never explained that, or that should what be is a like the Sandria, like the yeah. The it should be in in the beginning about the school system and really like show it how the French school system works for mm -hmm. the volunteers who will come to work in the schools. Yeah, and what is like a regular schedule of the students, yeah. then you become aware that they're sometimes from eight to six in class. Yeah. So. Just taking people that actually speak French since the beginning at Here it's necessary. intermediary level, because it's necessary in the school, because it's not a fact of the students, it's the fact that when you arrive, nobody speaks English in the school. <coughs> So it's gonna be super difficult to get integrated in mm -hmm. the school if, I mean, you don't know the teacher, you don't know no one, and then you don't even know the language. I mean, it just became so much to deal with. So, like, you should know the language if you want to interact mm -hmm. since the very first beginning. I agree in that sense that they still feel kind of alienated uh, in the school. Like, I see how Arthur like just yeah. speaks fluently and has like students as his, as his friends, but me, I'm like. Yeah, the students know that I'm the volunteer from Mystical Land. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. But also to be like, also more simple, to be like spontaneous with students. Sometimes you just want to say something, I don't know, funny or make a joke. You cannot because yeah. you're yeah. not fluent in the language, so you cannot do that. I mean, if it's a plus if you know that, but... If you English speak some words yeah. and then they gave us the document with like, here are some basic French words. Come on, Sambhavi, <laughs> how are you? <laughs> I just hope that we, as uh, we speak about our, our, our opinion, like in the future, they will acknowledge it, maybe. Yeah.